Hello everyone, it is Father Andy with Co-Design Support Team again. Uh, we're here to go over another Co-Design script, um, a fairly new one. Just going to give everybody a rundown of how it works. So uh, right here, I've got three vehicles and I have a boat down here and we're just going to kind of go over the features of it. So this is the right hand super drive um, car. So if you get in um the command is v control as you can see here now even on right-handed vehicles it's going to show me in the passenger side of this so if i wanted to move from the passenger side to the driver's side i'd do it here there is a stop start button top left there is also a key locks Opening doors, one and two. Now, if you wanted to close all doors, you just hit the close under here. Open, opens all of them. As far as the hood and trunk, you hit close again and close them all. Now you can open these individually and then close them individually. Windows are here. As you can see, it rolled down this window, this window, and these two over here. You can also open this UI by flexing your in muscle by default. And then to close them all, just hit close. Same thing with windows. If you want to open them all, just hit open. Um, on this particular model car, I only have one extra and it's the skirt right here. Um, if I had multiple liveries i could switch them here this is a option in the config if you don't want people to be able to do this i just have it on for this video lights so there is a dome light in here as well as neons that you can toggle just like that signal lights hazards so what i'll do is i will open all my windows I'm going to set the time to nighttime. That way you guys can see this. So if I turned my dome light on, as you can see, there is a little light in here that shows, you know, a dome light. Same thing with the neons. You can turn them on and off here. Our settings tab is mostly just your theme you can change your theme i'm more of a dark kind of guy so i'll leave mine there and then obviously scale is make it bigger or smaller and then if you want to close it you just take close all right now this this ui does it gets the uh, amount of vehicle or amount of seats that you have in a vehicle so it, it comes in pretty handy like for instance this bus We'll go over to controls. As you can see, it's got 12 different seats here. And we can open all the doors. It opens all of the uh, doors on the side, opens your back hatch. Then we hit close, close them all. Same thing with windows, so on and so forth. Now, if I wanted to move the seat I was sitting in all I have to do is go down the line here and it gets individual sheet seats and you can swap through all of them same thing is with the lights here dome light um, if this fan had neons it would show neons also does helicopters and planes so i'll hop in a helicopter here we're gonna get on the passenger side i have no start because i am not in the um driver's seat so if i swap over I'm able to start stop same thing I can open doors open windows Let's get a little bit closer here 
close them. Change seats. This particular helicopter does have a livery. So like I said, you can switch it from here. This is a config option to reiterate. Lights, dome light. Now I have a boat down here just to show you guys the difference between it. All right, so another cool feature about the UI is if you're on the driver's side, you can open up all the windows. You can do all the doors. But if I move to the passenger side, I can only do the passenger side door and the passenger side window. And then if I move back to the driver's side, because this all updates in real time, I rip off my door here. You see that it's red and you can even do it while you're driving. You can leave this open, rip off your other doors. As you can see, they instantly went red. All right. So same thing. You switch seats on the boat. Um, the number of seats are going to be dependent on how many actual seats there is for a person in your boat or vehicle. Um, lights. There is a dome light here. Toggle it on and off. Settings. Lock. It's all pretty much the same for vehicles. If you have any questions, make sure you open a ticket on Co-Design's Discord.